Hello my friends and welcome back to the Deep Tarot. This is one of the series, How You See Them Versus Reality. Everything you need to know about the schedule of the channel is in the description box. Keep in mind, this is a general reading, so it may not resonate with all of you and energy could be vice versa. I'm gonna tell you a short story and you decide who is who in this story. So if you are new, please subscribe and hit that notification button. So each time I post something new, you will be notified. And if you feel like it, please hit like and comment on the comment section. That will help my channel a lot to grow. I appreciate the help, thank you. Let's see. This is how you see them physically, reality. How you see them mentally, reality. How you see them emotionally, reality is this person from the past uh, sorry uh, how you feel about them how they feel about you and when outcome excuse me Sorry. How you see them physically? You see them as the page of Pent the Knight of Pentacles. Sorry, reality is the Ten of Swords. Mentally, the the Knight of Cups, while they are justice. Emotionally, the Ace of Pentacles. Reality, the Five of Pentacles. I have a feeling this is an ex of yours. Someone very near and dear to your heart. And you think it's either an ex, like an ex from a long time. And for some others, this is a crush. I don't feel a real, rea real relationship right now with these cards here. What you think about them physically, you think that this person is the Knight of Wands. You think that they are very slow, taking their time, not pushing hard, just enjoying, chilling, you know, enjoying life, thinking about moving, but not really moving. Because your idea is because this person is a slow person. While your reality is this person is not slow. This person is in the Ten of Swords. It seems that this person is in a very hard position like right now in life. Maybe they had a problem, <clears throat> health problem, let's hope not. But maybe it's kind of a health problem, financial problem. A karma within with someone in their life something happened in this person and they are in the ten of swords this person is completely destroyed even if they are trying to show that they are the knight of pentacles reality this person is destroyed they have so many problems they feel defeated you know they feel that they are now in, not in a good position at all. How you see them mentally? You see them as the Knight of Cups. You think this person is ready for love. Thinking about a relationship with, in general, like let's not talk about you specifically, but you think that this person, everything in their life is perfect and they can go for a relationship anytime they take the decision to go for a relationship this person the reality is justice this person having problems a, a serious problems not problems about pain and leaving uh, ex or a problem with a partner no this person is having a serious problems in life 
something with like financial they have a court situation something like something serious real this person in a position where they cannot think they don't have time to think about love or relationships they are draw, de they are deep deep in a in a horrible situation i believe on top if this is your ex or someone you had something with long time ago i feel this person want justice with you i feel this person understood that they treat you wrong and what they did to you you didn't deserve You didn't deserve what they did to you. Maybe for some of you, this person think that what happened in their life is that karma from your, from you because of you. I don't feel this person doesn't want to start something with you. I believe this person based on the situation that they are in, they cannot start anything right now. They are, maybe they have a money problem as well. How you see them emotionally, you see them as the ace of pentacles, while they are the five of pentacles. Emotionally, this person knows that you left them and you are not coming back. And they are not in a position to try to bring you back. This person feels that they lost you. They lost you. And they cannot do anything about it right now based on the situation that they are in. So if you think that this person is ready and not giving you any offer of love because they don't want or they are slow, this person is not ready at all. As I told you, I feel this person based on the cards that I'm seeing is not, they don't have maybe time to sleep not time to think about love they are not in a position to have a relationship with anyone or start something new with anyone or reconciliation or, or reconcile with anyone at all this person right now is on the survive mood barely surviving this person is trying to build themselves themselves up again and now they they are on the deepest down on ground they didn't even start to build but maybe this is their plan so i don't think this person is in a position to offer anything to anyone let's see how you feel about them the nine of pentacles and how they feel about you the hanged man you are in, this person hanged with you. They have emotions for you. They wish if the situation in their life is different, that they can go back to you. This person is wishing that America, like, being with you again is a miracle. And that miracle will not happen right now. This person is in the deep down, but they are hanged with you emotionally. 
while you are in the nine of pentacles i feel you are independent even emotionally i don't think that you are attached to this person or feeling i can't say you don't feel anything towards them but you are not attached to them as much as they are attached to you you are in a good position right now you are in the nine of pentacles very beautiful energy you are watching this person looking at them wishing that maybe they can come forward to you but you're very fine right now you're okay you're stable independent beautiful mature you have it all but based on feelings you are not attached to this person and hanged in this energy or this relationship like them you are you still think about this person but you are ready to explore the new this person is hanged to you they can't be with you and they can't be with anyone else and they can let you go emotionally let's see the outcome the six of cups it seems this is a soulmate relationship where you will keep feeling love towards them and they will keep feeling the love towards you this is a nostalgic feelings i think both of you have but what I feel is this person sending you energy kissing you goodbye this person is changing something in their life or leaving or doing something there is something new in this person's life maybe they will not be around if you see them from time to time what I felt from this card, that this boy coming to the girl, give her the flower because he is leaving. Kissing her goodbye. I want to take one card as advice for you. But I loved your energy. You are in the nine of pentacles, with, which is very good. What I'm gonna, what this reading is telling you, you are way in a much better position than this person, even if they are not showing that. But reality, this person is in a very bad place right now. It's these cards, all these cards together, together give me the impression of a tower moment or something like that. Let's take an advice for you. Queen of Swords and Three of Swords. My feeling. This is you. And this is them. I had a feeling from all these cards and the, the Six of Cups like prove it to me then after that the three of swords that this person feel that they found what they were looking for but they lost it and they lost it forever this person is acting deep inside them in this situation with no hope this person has no hope at all that they can have any chance with you in any time soon so they they are hanged to you emotionally and energetically but they are dropping the situation completely and they will keep you in their heart as a bit 
a beautiful memory. Something happened to them and that something was the best thing ever happened to them. But they were blind to see that. And they realized what they had after it was too late. I will give you advice from me based on what I'm seeing here. Don't wait for this person because this person is not coming back. I'm sorry the reading came like that, but based on what I'm saying here, this person is kissing you goodbye. They can't be with you. They, they, they need plenty of time to build their life. This person not ready to be with anyone. Their focus is only how to be stable and grounded. This is the goal right now. Emotions and feelings and relationships is not their concern at all. Well, thank you so much for being with me, my friends. Wish you all the best. I hope this was a helpful reading. Starting new is not wrong. Don't hate this idea. Because if this is not that it doesn't, sorry. If this is not meant to be, it's not meant to be. Fighting the energy only will let you lose time and opportunities in life. That's all. Don't hate the idea of changing. You don't have to change today. Every one of us will go for, like will drop the past and start anew in their own time. No one can convince you if you are not ready. But keep this idea in your mind so, we'll, so you can move this process. Heal yourself. When we heal ourselves, we open our eyes to see what's in front of us, in front of us, the reality, not the dream and the wishful thinking. In my opinion, what hurts us is the wishful thinking. We imagine the people that are in front of us the way we want them to be. And during this journey, there is so many signs will come to you and tell you, this is not what you think it is, but we ignore it. So if we want to be fair and honest with ourselves, we hurt ourselves. Nobody hurt us. Because if you are alert and opening your eyes and your heart to see, you will catch the lies that this person is telling you. You are not seeing because you don't want to see. Address the problem so you can solve it. I'm really sorry this became very harsh maybe, as I told you before. I, want, I don't want to give you a pain relief. We are looking for a medicine. You will never hear here what you want to hear. I will always tell you what you need to hear. Don't hate me. I'm only the messenger. Thank you so much for being with me, my friends. Wish you all the best. Have a great day. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.